No, I should have started this episode with doing huh. this. Because it's how we ended the last one. <laughs> anyway, welcome back to Super Paper Mario, guys. And today's episode is the Dicking Around episode. I love dicking around. Yep, so feel free to skip to the next... I mean... <laughs> <laughs> what if we say something funny? We'll do a lot of recipe stuff, but I want to do this first. Oh, thank God. Yeah, yeah, 300. We get a pipe. This is a good thing, yeah? We're getting started. Just stay another way. What does he remind me of? He looks like a character from Kirby's Epic Yarn. Oh, he's finished. Yep. This pipe opens 24-7 a day, 365 days a year. You are using it, whatever, yeah? Wise right, people are always being so efficient. You made a wise decision. Well, I am going. I don't think we ever see him again. <laughs> Good. No, I, I hate his meatball looking ass. <laughs> that made me new. You could, you could have done that shit for free and said he's like, oh, 300 coins and I'll do this in like three seconds. Yeah, I'm gonna save. I don't wanna do that again. Anyway, in the last one, we did something. Yeah, we, we finished uh, chapter five. <laughs> and it took forever. One chapter took 50 minutes <laughs> because well, I couldn't fight. Yeah, Same I was about to say, to be fair, that flower took you like 10 minutes to beat up. Yeah, shut up. Don't tell them that. You're being very rude. Also, I need to bring out my spreadsheet. Oh. I made a spreadsheet for the recipes. Oh, wow. There you go. You can see the recipes. Oh, my goodness. <laughs> to the side, it shows like, uh, like what ingredient. You made this? Yeah, I made it. I should have you do my spreadsheets. I'm gonna make the best recipe first, okay? So here here you go, kids. You take um actually let me see it. <laughs> okay, I was way off. I was at the beginning and then she just like went like all the way to the end. It's like a Koopa thing. I think it's a Ah, oh, here it is. It's a Turk it's okay, you take one of these. Alright, and then you take one of these. And okay. then you mix it together and it makes a thing. I can't tell you how much I need to cough right now, but I don't want to. You want me to just mute the mic real quick? Yeah. That and we're really back. Disgusting. <laughs> he threw up. Yeah, I puked everywhere. I was like, Ugh. yeah, and it only took me like one second to do that. Yeah, cooking dish G. You using it will increase the data in my memory bank. Would you like to use it? No. Yeah. Data complete. Searchable items have been increased. Please select the recipe or ingredient you want to know more about. So yeah, but now we got the sixth one. Gorgeous steak. Yeah, it's fucking beautiful. That's, like, that's like me, except you take out the gorgeous part. You're a steak? Yeah, I am a steak. Yeah. A mistake. Oh. Odd dinner. Po <laughs> poison shroom and a fried shrimp plate. Oh yeah, this is where we get the the dialis, uh shit. Yeah, that's how you're supposed to make it, is a shrimp shake and a spicy soup, not an egg and a shrimp shake like we did. <laughs> yeah, there's a lot of recipes. I was, I was off screen getting a shit ton. Um, Did you ever figure out how to expand your items? No. <laughs> I think this is the max. <laughs> but, uh, fuck. Can I just put one of these two together? I think. I don't know. Let me try it. Hey, can you throw this shit together in a pot? Uh, here's a peach. And here the shrimp shake. Give me something with that. Yeah, so we're gonna have to go to that first lady for. What's that? To just cook it, like, just one item. Also, I love how she, like, throws her ladle up and then just never catches it. No, she caught it. I'm pretty sure she just throws <gasps> a fruity shroom. Nice! That's what I call my friends. A, sh a fruity, fruity shroom. shroom? Who the fuck are you calling shroom? <laughs> you. Aw, oh, that's so nice. Yeah, Anyway, we have to go shroom. down here now. Because this elevator's not open. Sweet, and we get to go drink at the bar. Wait, do they have a fish here too? You know, the other place uh, had milk. This place serves coffee. Oh shit! <gasps> Wait, they got one of the things that way you—it's the old timey coffee makers and whatnot. That like it heats up the coffee at the top and then lets it drip down, so you get like. The... Mm -hmm. It looks like an hourglass. You you are an hourglass. Oh, what's this? <gasps> let's go gambling! <laughs> oh dang it! Oh, what's this? Hey, look, we found it to cooking just me. That's awesome. 
Hey, we got darts in the board. Yeah, I gotta... Have you ever played darts before? No, I don't think so. Like, uh, I remember having this this set when I was younger. It was like magnetic dark, uh, darts, like... Oh, you... so you wouldn't, like, puncture the wall? Yeah. Uh, Damn. Well, well two, two things to that. Number one, uh, I was bad with the magnetic darts. I'm actually better with the real darts. We What we did one time was we went to this, uh, this like, the beach house that had, like, a bunch of games and whatnot. And they had a, a dart board. Um, and... Me, uh, me and my friends decided it'd be a really good idea to just drink a bunch and then play darts. Um, <laughs> Sorry. <laughs> probably wasn't our wisest decision, yeah. but no one got hurt. No, so. that's good. Yeah. Uh, the wall got a little hurt, but yeah. it, it, it's alright. Um, but uh, what that leads me into is talking about... Uh, have you ever heard of... Uh, what are they called? Lawn darts? Or garden darts? I, I forget what I they're think? called. I think. They're like the... They're like the Big ass, big ass darts that people would throw in like, like in the grass outside. No. It was, it was like a game in like the, like the eighties or nineties, and they're banned in the U.S. because really people, people were getting darts thrown at them, and they were like, <laughs> they were like big ass darts. Yeah. Like, <laughs> Hello there, I'm Flam, the map chap. I sell the hidden treasures of the world. So, are you into maps or what? Because this chap is. Oh, these maps I sell? They got great pictures, pictures of treasures. Each map shows you where to go, and then you go find the treasure, it's yours. So, what do you think? I mean, it's cool, right? And you're here, so buy one. Do it. Pick a map. I'm the map. I'm the map. I'm the map. So this will bring you to different places that we've already been to. Dude. And then you get a little, like, sometimes you get, like, an item, you get, like, a card. It all depends on where the location is. Can, I you, will get can you go to these locations without the map? Or do you need no, the map? No, you need the order? map in order to trigger it. Uh, I, was, I, know, so I was think I was thinking that because I was like I was like that'd be kind of lame if you just like didn't need the maps and Turkish analysis can I do it without the map? <laughs> he goes like nah you can't and I kill myself or something. I mean if I was making this game, what you have a trigger with the map? Yeah. Yeah. I, uh, I mean I that does make map. sense. Because otherwise then it'd be just like lame because you could just stumble upon these things or just like look them up. Yeah. I have no sense of achievement with them. Yeah. I just realized they're all the colors of the rainbow. Yeah, the pure hearts. All right. Flip. Is it this one? Okay, wrong. Is it this one? Okay. Is it this one? It's that one. A gold bar. We're well, gonna cook things. it. <laughs> Cooking lady just throws a, a gold bar at this bitch. Just clunks her head. So yeah, there's a pipe. Yeah, I'm sorry if I cough during this recording. I'm How still sick. How fucking dare you? Yeah. Actually, we actually did need to catch up on Super Mario because uh, Phoenix Wright was taking uh, quite a lead ahead of Ed. So hey, it balances it out more. Yeah, we were pounding it out, so <laughs> we, we, we stopped doing a couple of the Phoenix Wright recordings because uh, I cannot voice anyone other than me, Wait. myself, and I. <laughs> yeah, Magic Gumshoe shows up. <laughs> yeah, I think I think I would actually be so depressed. There you go. Are you actually cooking a gold bar? Yeah. You're cooking up a hundred coins? Yeah. And we need for a recipe. Yeah, it's on... Uh... Wait, is it, is it, wait, hey, wait, 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 hey, you messed it up. No, uh you did. It looked like that, oh, that's meal. space food. Golden meal. Perfect! Recipes! There it is. Yep. You need a gold bar. How much does this sell for? I put it on there. 50, 50. coins! Awesome! Wow. Yummy. It feels like it's being. Here's poison. So you just took half its value by cooking it. Yeah. Hey, it was free. So technically, yeah, certainly. No, it wasn't. You cost a tw it cost twenty coins. Anyway, I cook a peachy peach. <laughs> I want you to guess what it turns into, because I know what some of these recipes are. <laughs> you should have put this in alphabetical order. Yeah, I put a filter on it. What filter did you put on it? You can. I just put it like in order from like how it is in like the game. So it technically is organized by like by this standard. Shit, not that. How long did this take you? 
uh, two hours. I just want it all together so I can physically see like what I'm missing when I'm like off screen grinding out ingredients, you know? I was gonna say like, weren't you supposed to be working? But I'm, I'm not gonna lie, I've been sick today. I've been like resting half of the day. Yeah. I mean, granted, I, t I told my boss that that's, that that's what, was, what I was gonna I be doing. I did one sheet of bill outs and then uh, I did inspections, that was it. And I couldn't even do half the scheduled inspections I was asked to because for some reason they weren't popping up on the website. They were, no matter what I did for the address, it just wouldn't show up for me to select it. And I'm like, ah, shit, so I gotta do that tomorrow. Yeah. Uh, this one. Yeah, cook up that primordial fruit. I bet it's gonna become a primordial fruit cake. You're so smart. Yeah. My brain is working overdrive. <laughs> Your brain is very large. Yeah, it's like, oh, it's a town special. Yeah. Downtown to crack on specialty. All of these cure poison. Yeah. I was like expecting, you know, like, oh, it might help with, like, no, oh, sorry. It might help with, like, other status ailments and stuff like that other than poison, but I guess poison is the only status ailment in this game. Yeah, and there's curses, too, which I think they can heal from that. Mm -hmm. Reminds me, there, there's this one, there's this one anime mm -hmm. that I don't recommend anyone watching. Oh, is it the one you watch four episodes of and you're yes. like, this sucks? <laughs> the, the, the main premise of the, uh, like, the, the main character, he's like, uh, he can, like, inflict status ailments on people, mm -hmm. on, like, people and monsters, and it's, like, not supposed to work on, on, like, demons, but his actually does, mm -hmm. and he's, like, I guess overpowered because of that, but, uh, like, like the whole like start of the show is just like him going like like paralyze, poison, and then he'll like go like sleep and stuff. Like, and that just made me think of like, uh, like the status elements in this game. And I was like, I was like, oh, the only thing I, I've ever seen is poison. How, and have we even been poisoned once? Uh, no, I haven't been hit by one of those poison people yet. Wait, no, sleep is a thing in this game, because the the little button, butt yeah, shape but, things... Yeah, but then you just go like this, secure it. I don't think you can pause during it. <coughs> Same thing when you're frozen, too. You, that one just, like, you just shake. Speaking of sleep... Let me buy a sleepy sheep. Yeah, ignore, the, the, ignore the dogs barking. Yeah, yeah, how dare they? They're barking. We just had someone I'm come up to us. I'm too poor to get it! <laughs> Let me go sell this real quick. We just had someone co uh, come up to the front door, and they were like, they were like, oh, like, uh, like you're voting for 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 Trump, right? And and my my brother answered the door. I was I was just gonna close the door and <laughs> and just walk away. <laughs> you're not even saying <laughs> because I, I don't I don't feel like answering crap like that. Uh, yeah, bye. but it just makes me it, it makes me think about the I've been getting texts lately about. Uh, Mm -hmm. About like the election and whatnot, and they'll like text me like they're like they're like, do you want to be an advocate for like uh, like politician so and so? Like we'll pay you up to like two hundred dollars a week or something like that just to like talk about this stuff. And I literally would say like, yeah, I'd rather kill myself than than, <laughs> than do this. I literally send them back a message saying that, which is sad because they didn't respond. But damn, dude, I got one of those because um I use Google like, Google Voice for work, and I got a message like that asking about, like, Trump, and I'm like, were there a lot of- this is a business line, they can't just message us like this. No, they'll- they'll do they whatever still, yeah, they, they want. Yeah, they still will. Uh, yeah, just draw this shit in storage real quick. Do we have a QA? I'm gonna put that in storage, too. I'm just drawing recipes at this man. Just like, yeah, hold on to that. Have you ever gotten like any any messages from someone that's like uh, that, like you don't know and they're trying to reach like like oh, yeah. like like someone else like who I guess had your number before? Oh no, mine's been an original number. I did have a lady reach to me, being like, it's like it's been a while, and and I'll. I'm like, sorry, who is this? I'm like, wow, even after all these years, you still like you told me remember me that. Like, some shit like that, and I was like, wait, is this Flair? So I just, like, messaged back Flair, like, question mark? Because I, like, I had no idea who else could, be, like, act like that. And they're like, no, it's, like, whatever, and I'm like, oh, this is the wrong number. But they think I was someone else, so I just went with it. <laughs> and they're like, wait, is this not Aunt Barbara? And I'm like, 
Yeah, why? <laughs> and they never got back to me. <laughs> I, the, the, I told them I was the wrong number the first time, and they acted like like I was in the wrong. <laughs> I was like, "Well, guess I guess I am." <laughs> yeah, they, uh, there's apparently the person who had my old phone number was named fucking like Tanya or something like that. Mm -hmm. And so I'll get calls, and they'll be like, they'll "Be like, hello, is this is this Tanya?" And I'm like, "Do I sound like a Tanya to you?" <laughs> and they're like, and they just hang up. <laughs> <laughs> but then, uh, what's annoying is like some people will. Uh, will call me and they'll they'll say like uh they'll they'll start out saying like oh is this Cameron and I'll be like I'll be like yeah this is him and then they'll start like spewing some like spam or like scam bullshit my and favorite it's, like, spectrum it's it's like I I hate when they do that shit because whenever they introduce themselves like or like uh they like say like oh is this so and so and like yeah. they'll say my name I always think that it's like oh like a doctor or something like yeah. that that's that's calling me and I know that they do that tactic just to, just because people just think like that. Just to piss you off. But it makes me so fucking mad. That's why I'm glad, like, I'm not on, like, hardly any social media or anything. Because, like, my phone number is not connected to many, yeah. many things. What's always helped me is that I think it can help you, too, because now you're an LLC. Whenever you answer the phone you don't know the number, you can just answer it like you're a business. And then they're required to take it off because it's a business line. It's, that's why they was like, oh, thank you for calling, so blah, 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 how may I help you? And then they will start, start to, like, they'll be, like, silent and be like, hello? And then I'll just hang up, and then I stop receiving spam texts and calls, because they think it's a business well, line. Well, I don't want to do that, because it, what if it is my doctor, and they're going to be like, oh, this is the wrong number. I don't know. I get, maybe if you know it's not, I don't know. I mean, that's how I've always done it. I don't know. And if they were like, hi, is this blank? Then you'd just be like, yeah, how can I help you? Like, and that's, yeah, just do that. Anyway, we're gonna buy a shit ton of these. Yeah. We need to cook all these. I, um... No! No. Oh, what was it? Oh, yeah, I was trying to schedule an appointment earlier for, like, a... Like, a, a dermatologist. Mm -hmm. And... Uh, and, like, I went onto their portal because I was like, oh, it's probably easier than just, like, calling because, like, half the time when I call, they have to put me on hold and then they have to, like, figure out all this stuff with scheduling between me and them and then I'll have to check my schedule. I was like, it'd just be easier to see it all. Like, I'm a, I'm a better, like, visual person yeah. than anything. And, and so I was like, oh, I'll just go onto their portal and, and do all this stuff. Number one, getting to their portal wasn't fucking impossible. Mm. Number two, I had to download an app to get onto their portal. Yeah. And number three, as soon as I got onto the portal, I couldn't even fucking make an appointment. So I was like, <laughs> you I, know just, I just nothing. call them. Like, yeah. I was like, this is so, this is so fucking bullshit. And then, uh, back on that note, to, uh, in order for me to, like, make a, make a business bank account for my LLC and whatnot, I have to go into the bank and do all that, and do all that crap in person. I can't just, like, do it online. I guess that makes such sense. A freaking pain in my butt. I get, if it was, like, a personal bank account, you probably can do it online, but since it's a business one, they gotta verify a bunch of shit. Well, it's not like they even have to verify a bunch of stuff, they just, like, have to, uh, uh, they, like, need, like, my, like, social security number, and then, like, the employee identification number that's like assigned with my LLC which I have that stuff that I could give them and it's just like because like banks really like for you to open up bank accounts with them yeah, yeah. they really enjoy that and so they make it super easy but mm -hmm. they make it not easy enough where I could just like do it online I'm like we live in a technological age just let me do this shit online all you Here, need is these, this. all you need is these two documents yeah like but yeah that's that's my rant hey. so so lesson out there for anyone don't become a contractor. Just it, it, just find a full-time job. No, you should have just had your company just still pay you directly. <laughs> I know they would bitch at you about it, but that feels like, uh, just, just do it that way. Well, you see, like, uh, there's, like, special cases where people uh, people can, can do that, but, like, for tax purposes, I don't think they want to do that with me. Yeah. They're trying to, like, they're getting more people, and so they're trying... This is, like, the time when they're trying to, like, nail these things down and, yeah. and be, like more professional when it comes to like how they handle contractors and whatnot because yeah. like oh, my dad used to be a contractor for this business did he have to open up an llc no because he was a special case like i said and oh. and they knew that like eventually they probably want to bring him on yeah and which is why i'm like i want them to bring me on too yeah so i don't have to deal with all this crap but but no <laughs> things gotta be difficult for cameron yeah it's okay 
So you know this uh, this thing is only like a eighty percent chance of <laughs> actually baking what we want. Perfect. That's exactly what I wanted. A fried egg. Thank you. <coughs> it, it really is an eighty percent probability. The other ninety two, you get mistakes or other recipes like a healthy salad or fucking moose or some shit like that. There's a lot of cake recipes in this too. All right, what do I got this time? Another fried egg. A coupe of tea. This is the first time I, I don't have to waste a coupe leaf with this. It's, oh, a, yeah. it's a play on words. Instead of a, a cup of tea, it's a coupe of tea. Yeah. Also, I want to point out that off screen, I went back over to the the f chapter five one and whatnot to train off of the the piranha plants to get all the like the um because they have like the peach. The peachy peach, the keel thing, the veggie, the horsetail, whatnot. And I, I, I could not stop getting fucking horsetails. And, like, I looked at all the recipes. I think there's only, like, you need four of them. Like, total for all the recipes in the game. I, I got, like, fucking seven. <laughs> <laughs> nice. I'm like, that's awesome. That's exactly what I wanted. Which I guess we can go to the inventory at the shop, at the shop and take out the horsetail to get that done. I just made a bunch of fucking mistakes. Oopsies. I am a mistake. No. Wait, did you want to look at the recipes? No, I don't really care that much. Oh, you don't want to see how cool the designs are? No. Oh, I worked hard on my spreadsheet. <laughs> <laughs> Asshole. Yeah, you worked hard on your spreadsheet. All you're doing is just sitting here putting a bunch of mystery boxes into the... It's an 80% chance! I will only know if it's a heart and a fucking rainbow. Oh, I will take that. Thank you. Now, if we get a honey jar with that, then I can make a fucking abomination. <laughs> is it literally called abomination? I don't remember. Let me see. <laughs> you literally mix a honey jar with a honey candy, and it's supposed to be like a sticky, sweet... A mess. Where's my phone? <laughs> I just had it. Where is it? Do you have my phone? No. Oh, are you, why are you blaming me? Oh wait, what are we getting? <gasps> inky, inky soup. Inky soup. I love it. Oh, inky. you made me ink. That was our first time cooking that. We don't have to waste a fucking inky sauce on that. <laughs> <laughs> oh yeah, it's called a heavy meal. Mixing together a honey jar and a honey candy. Why did they call me heavy in the meal? Yeah, it looks like that. Oh gosh. To be fair, it's a stack of honey on top of each other. Thing looks like it would make me fucking shit bricks. Girl, you made my earthquake. No, this is the one. The probability of this being the one is <coughs> it's high, I think. I don't know. I don't know how statistics work. It's gonna be a mistake. Well, it's not a mistake. You know, sell more than one cent. Fuck yeah! Bye! Oh, wait, wait, wait. Take my cake mix I got for free. Does she make a cake out of it? I think she makes cookies. <laughs> out of cake mix? Don't question her. I'm questioning her. I can't wait to, after this episode, I get to go on my spreadsheet with the game open and check off things that we've made. <laughs> Yay! A sweet cookie snack. How Thank dare you. she make that with cake mix? Well, they don't want fucking cookie mix in this game. Leave her alone. Where's the. Oh, it's all the way over here. I forgot. There's so much to do and so much to see. So, what's wrong with taking the back streets? Because back streets, back. Alright! Sorry, I'll go kill myself. I wasn't supposing that, I was just listening. Wow, Electro Pop's worth 82? It's from a Thunder Rage. You got it from a mystery box. Yeah. <laughs> this is our crate opening. It's us just fucking cooking mystery boxes. <laughs> oh, oh my gosh, Electro Pop! <laughs> I'm gonna shit myself. I will keep that honey candy, because we just need a honey jar, which I think we can just get it easily from uh, one of the little tiny houses nearby, if my memory serves correctly. What if your memory doesn't serve you correctly? I would kill myself. It's probably not very good for your health, to be honest. Yeah, you're probably right. 
Cup of tea. Cup of tea. Fried egg. Hey, we basically turn around profit. This is probably the easiest way to get a profit. Just buy $3 mystery boxes and then just pick them in the oven. And there you go. I will... I'm gonna pick up a couple things. Let me grab... Uh, yeah, give me one of these. Yes, thank you. And then give me... I never got... Uh... Shit, I actually never got one. Damn. I never got a mango. I will get one of these. Okay, then make the spicy soup. We already have the inky soup. I'm trying to remember just cooking the fucking cocoa bean doesn't uh, anything, but I'm assuming no. Like, just by itself. Do you get a town special? Uh, we'll just roll with this. And let me see if I can find that honey jar. This is this is the recipe episode, <laughs> and then we're like at the end we're just gonna throw the heart <laughs> the heart in the pillar. Yeah, how do you get a honey jar? Uh, it's... is it something you buy or is yeah it like... you buy it? I okay. think I remember where to buy it because it's at, I think it's the same place that you buy the cake mix. It's down here next to Flint and Guy. Oh yeah, we can check up on the fish. I love the fish. Look at the fish. How big is he? Oh, he's so much bigger. Come did, on, you did can he do eat something? That's a goldfish. He's a cute fish that the boy on the third floor loves. He seems happy to have a large area to swim in. It's much better than the bull. Oh, and I hear his name is Captain Gills. Did Captain Gills eat that person? Yeah. Good job, Captain Gills. At least he doesn't eat us. Hey, what do you got today? Just curiosity. He's got cake mix. He's got thunder rage. Fisherman. Yeah. Golden leaf. You can cook that and get a gold bar from it. Oh, really? Yeah. <laughs> you do that in the first two games, too. Okay, That's I profit. super shank. I will hold off. Thank you, though. Yeah, another tiny house. Tiny house for tiny people. This is me visiting Jolene at her house. <laughs> I meant it because she was short. <laughs> I was like, That's kind of fucked up. I'm sorry. <laughs> See? Let's buy one of these. Thank you. Should we try to find where that heart pillar is? I think she said outskirts of Flopside. I'm Thanks assuming so. if if Flipside is supposed to be like the like these supposed to be like mirrors of each other, it's probably on the outskirts where we did the whole peach thing. Yeah. That's what I'm assuming. But I will go throw things at this lady real quick just to cook them. <laughs> I love cooking. I love I love cooking. You know what? Since since it's been a while since I've asked any questions for people to comment about, I'm curious if y'all have a favorite dish to cook or something that you know someone <laughs> like cooks for or, you. Yeah. Yeah. Any anything like that? Leave it in the comments below. I, um, I'll tell you right now. I like baking the cheese, the cheddar cheese biscuits from Aldi. <laughs> They're my favorite. What What about like a normal dish? What's your like favorite kind of a meteor meal? Uh, let me, maybe a nice steak and potatoes, like from the, like the Outback Steakhouse. I see the disappointment in your eyes. No, I'm not disappointed. I'm just, th okay. I'm just thinking, I'm trying to think of like what I would answer as. I think that for like food wise, I don't know what my favorite thing to, to make is. Cause like there's some dishes that take like a little bit. To, to make and those are kind of nice because like you feel kind of rewarded after yeah. after you make it so like after like I've smoked something for a while and like you know put a lot of like thought and effort into it mm -hmm. it feels it feels good to make uh, something like that oh like a brisket because I know that one's very time consuming yeah or or it doesn't even have to be a brisket like uh, we smoked some uh, ooh actually the smoked salmon that I that I make with like brown sugar on mm -hmm. it. Oh, that's really good. If if we're not getting you hungry, then uh. I'm hungry right now. I was talking before we started recording. <laughs> I was gonna ask if you wanted to eat, but then you plop down. and You're like, all right, you ready to record? And I'm like, oh, I guess we'll do this. <laughs> yeah, I'm a big fan of making of making smoked salmon or um, 
Shrimp and grits. Uh, you know what? I've never eaten good grits. My parents made some when we were on, like, camping, but I didn't really like them that much. The, Maybe grits aren't for me. The the, the key for, like, a, a good shrimp and grits is to is to make it so that it feels like the, the grits are, like... Because, like, one of the things that people can't get past when it comes to grits is, like, the texture. Yeah, it tastes like sand. <laughs> so uh, what we usually do, we being, like, my dad and I, is... We'll, uh, we'll pound, like, butter and, like, cheese you and... pound them? And, and whatnot into it, basically making it so it doesn't taste like grits anymore. Nice. And, um, uh, and then we'll make shrimp with that, and oh my gosh, it's so good. Which I get I love breakfast foods so much. I think anyone can know that, though. <laughs> well, you just have a sweet tooth. What the fuck? <laughs> Wait, hold on. For the pillar. It's a heart floating in the air. It looks like it's a pure heart, but what is it? Is it gonna- do we have the- what are you- huh? Is it- is it this? What do we do? It's just- it The just, texture's in loaded. It's just floating there. Menacingly. What are we supposed to do? Is, are we not supposed to do this until later on? Is this, is this the game soft blocking us from using that one? Maybe. That'd be really funny if that is. <laughs> Maybe that's where you're supposed to put the final one. They're just like, yeah, you can't do that yet. Dipshit. That kind of makes sense. Yeah. Get your shit together. Uh, bitch. <laughs> <coughs> I guess it's the other outskirts. Oh, I'm shit. saying bitch just kind of got me. <laughs> I was trying to think of a word. <laughs> I settled on bitch. <laughs> Hmm, that block seems suspicious. Oh no, oh no, oh no. <laughs> I meet. I did it. I saved the town. You still do six damage even when you're tiny. Oh. I'm a baby. <clears throat> I'm Looks just like a people just got here. I'm just a little guy. Oh, I thought you could like stay tiny and like hit things. With <gasps> oh, nice job. I missed. And I fired! And I fired! And I missed! This went on for several hours. Where does this go? Is this our heart pillar? Also, that, that means that guy lied. Because they said that someone, like a citizen, saw the heart pillar. But we had to make it appear. That guy lied. That guy's yeah. an asshole. That guy's gaslighting us. That's like gaslighting everyone. I'm not a fan of gaslighters. I prefer electrical ones. <laughs> what the hell? I hate that that one made me laugh. <laughs> You're just mad because I'm right. Am I though? Yeah. Look, that one's dark blue. That one's also a good chapter. Oh shit, that's uh, Normel. At the duel of the hundred, the hero will meet with dark powers of purest chaos. If you fall to the hundred, the chaos world grows and the purity heart fades. And as that happens, the hero will fall to the world where all games are ended. Thanks. That's in the section of the light prognosticus that I just deciphered. It seems to suggest that if you fail to pass these duels, all worlds will be ruined. And apparently your lives will be lost along with the purity heart. No one else can do this. I know that what I have just shared with you might only serve to discourage you. I still must send you forth, however. It saddens me that I can do nothing else. Thanks, bitch. Thanks, Nermal from, from Garfield. <laughs> <laughs> oh, we never put in the new uh, cooking disc that we found. It's just been in my inventory. This whole, this whole time? Also, I'm gonna buy more mystery boxes real quick. Can you imagine if I went to the wrong door and started the new world? <laughs> I like the aesthetic of World 6. It's very cool looking. It's just a little sad. Whee! Oh, how you fall every single time you come into this door. That implies that when the door was up there, maybe like it was a mountain and they shaved it down to that rock that they're, so <laughs> they're sitting on now. Yeah. Uh, yeah, give me some mystery boxes. 
Give me as many as my pockets can carry, please. All right, put the moxes in the bag. Put, put it in. in. Uh, you're facing the wrong way, sir. <laughs> All right, give me the boxes. Who the fuck is calling me? Hey, it's a number I don't know. Anyway. <laughs> Hello, we've been trying to reach you about your car's extended warranty. I don't know who that is. Dude, <laughs> I don't have a car. So they called on the fifth. People keep sending me <laughs> messages and they're like, uh, they're like, uh, we've, we've been trying to reach you about your car's extended warranty. I'm like, yeah, I'm I don't like, have a car. oh, what car? What extended warranty? <laughs> Fuck yeah. Did he ask me if I wanted to buy shit, but I couldn't buy shit? Thanks, asshole. So I'm gonna sell shit. Cause I don't think this isn't needed anymore. <laughs> You're not needed anymore. Get out of here. Get lost. Oh my god! Yes, yeah, so <laughs> food that's out of this world. There we go. Now we can buy more mystery boxes. I'm Is this so how happy. it's like to play CS:GO? <laughs> I guess to an extent. What do you mean to an extent? You you won't you don't do this? I mean, a lot of the game is not just buying cases. Every time I hear you play uh, talk about CS:GO, I hear you guys gambling about like <laughs> fucking cases and getting knives <laughs> and sometimes gloves. I don't know. I I saw you guys like being like, oh my god, oh my god, we saw all red. <laughs> one of us are bound to get it. <laughs> yeah, and then and then I got one and it was worth eight dollars, and we all spent each of us spent two hundred dollars on the opening. <laughs> Yeah, we spent six hundred dollars in total. We got like fifty back. Nice. It's not very profitable. Yeah. <laughs> you don't go into that thing uh, making a profit. Yeah, I can. I can tell. <laughs> yeah, you just go in for fun. Let's go gambling. Yada yada yada. Yeah yeah yeah. I love gambling. I love it. <laughs> yeah. So, uh, well, there's this one like there's this one content creator who does like a lot of the uh, like case openings and whatnot. And the, his like famous saying is uh is like remember uh, trust the numbers not your gut, because <laughs> he, he wants to tell people that like the odds are not in your favor for opening shit. Yeah. He's like, he's like he's like let me do the openings for you. Let you get the the rush of adrenaline from it. Yeah. He's like, he's like I'll spend the like hundreds of thousands of dollars on on cases and you guys yeah. can uh, can just sit back and enjoy the content. Yeah. And everyone's like yes. <laughs> Finally! Oh, believe me, I am enjoying the content. This is kind of like gambling. We're hoping for a, <laughs> for a miracle dinner. Is this the only way to get it? Yep, it's from a mystery box and 80% probability. I wish I was joking. Wait, so 80% of the time when you cook a mystery box, it, it can give it to you? Yep. Other times it's a mistake or you can get uh, like random meals. So, like, if you're trying to, like, fill out, like, the recipes ahead of time, you can just do this. And see how many you can get before you get the miracle dinner. And then you can then focus on getting the other recipes from it. So you've missed the 80% chance this many times? Yeah. I didn't say the odds were good. I just said that those were the odds. <laughs> the odds are supposed to be good. Yeah. We're looking for a heart and a rainbow. That's supposed to signify that we found it. That's not it. Yeah, I wouldn't expect that to have been it. But yeah, I washed all my plushies, and now they smell like laundry detergent. This one especially does. He was- <laughs> I guess when I finished the first round of plushies, I forgot to do the rinse and drain. So when I threw him in here, he got extra soaked, so when I picked him up, he was just like- It's like if you got a pillow wet. <laughs> yeah. Well, I mean, that's, that's in theory what he, pretty much what he is. Yeah. I pretty much use him as a pillow. I'm talking about my uh, my big chunk SMG4, just a piss off Sage. But, uh, yeah, like, I, I snuggle with him all the time because he, he's like the perfect size. Because usually I have like a pillow and then I have another pillow that I like I hold and shit. But, like, I can't really do that in this bed because I don't think a pillow, another pillow can be on here. So he's like perfect, because he's also a plush, and he can be <gasps> slimy extra. I don't have to do the thing anymore, thank fucking god. I don't have to get that stupid fucking yellow piece of shit. Yeah, this giant fucking plushie takes up like a third of our bed. And you wake up to it every morning. Yeah, I'm sick of it. No, <laughs> don't. Look at his fucking face and tell me that you're sick of him. 
You're taking up so much of my fucking bed. He's not that big. Nice, lots of mistakes. Your mistake. Fuck you. Is this all I did in my, my, my youth? Just, just spam mystery boxes? I thought this was supposed to be a really high chance. It's 8%! Oh! You were saying 80% the entire no, time. No, no, you, can you imagine? <laughs> we would have been done by now. No, it's 8. It's a 92% chance of getting everything else. Oh, I, Ooh, swear, I swear I was, I mean, you'll have to you'll have to go back to the recording, but I swear I, I asked you, I said, it's an 80% chance, and you said, yeah. Maybe I just heard you wrong. I'm sorry. I wish we could swing back over to the other one and, and make something happen. What happens if you combine two mistakes? I think you get a mistake. <laughs> Look at all the shit that we got. Yeah, four mistakes. And a slimy extract. Yay! I'm so excited! <laughs> Come on. We're going over. I'm gonna go make a heavy meal. <laughs> that's, that's what I call him. Never mind. <laughs> Me. <laughs> Where are you going? I'm going over to the the other side so I can make a heavy meal. Why, why don't you use the pipe? It's, f it's right on the same floor, it's fine. What if I wanted to see the beardy McBeardinson? And then, fuck you. Yeah, obviously. Someone's gotta do it. I, saw, I still can't tell if, if those are wings or if he's holding up, like, peace signs. I'm gonna assume they're wings because I like it. I like it better that way. He just has hands. <laughs> I don't think any of the other pixels have hands. Hi. Have a honey jar. Here's a honey candy. Thank you. Thank you. See, she just throws it up. Now, now keep watching, and she'll catch it. See? Oh, she does catch it. <laughs> Thanks, lady. <coughs> yeah, insert that. I didn't realize the heavy meal counts as like a mistake. Perfect. All the shit that I have to make. <laughs> so how did I get this? It's a long lasting shake and a peachy thing. God damn it. That's sappy soup. We made that. You're supposed to get a slimy shroom. You're supposed to get it. From sleeping in the inn upstairs and then going to the 3D afterwards. I'm so glad we don't have to do that. There's the slimy shroom. Yeah. They tell you like some location stuff, which is nice. I'm kind of glad they do. Sometimes the Macy Chasey's would drop this. So let's drop these. And it tells you like locations so where you get certain things. That's convenient. Yeah. That was nice of them. Yeah. At least they could do. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> it is the least I can do. Whee! Alright, I'm gonna... Alright, should we do one more round of mystery boxes before we, uh, yeah, retire? Yeah, Alright, let me, um... Yay! Let's go gambling! <laughs> oh, dang it. Um. I love mystery boxes. I love gambling! I love the fact that we're gonna get 700 mistakes. Yay! I just got a bunch of voicemails. Wait, actually? Did I get a voicemail from that person that called me? I said the last time they called me was on the 5th. Okay, that- oh, they did leave a voicemail. How come they left me a voicemail about? Wait, what's the number? Yes, that's- Oh, that's, shit! That, 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 that's, the, that's the same one that I got. Oh, it's a real estate agent. <laughs> Oopsies. And I just hung up on her. I feel so bad now. <laughs> All to play a video game. <laughs> good day. Yeah, it sure is a good day. It's fine. It's fine. Yeah, because you still need to submit your shit. Yeah, yeah. More reason for no one to, to be a, a contractor is... Uh, I'm not even getting real pay stubs. Yay. I'm just getting paid, which you know, I thought was fine, but apparently not. <laughs> yeah. So uh, 
Don't be a contractor. Yeah, you know what? I'll tell my dad that. <laughs> Don't do it. <laughs> Alright, get rid of that. I'm gonna put that honey jar away, and then we're just gonna load up on mystery boxes. <laughs> What should I tell this episode? Let's go gambling? It's basically gambling. And then the description just says, Aw, oh, dang it. Aw, <laughs> oh, dang it. Uh, no, 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 thank you. Uh, store this item, please. Now they share the same storage with each other, right? Yeah, they all pick up. Yeah. I was about to say, that'd be really annoying if they don't. No, they're all in cahoots. They fax it over. Yeah, you know annoying that would be as a game thing where you drop off something at like, and like chapter five two, and then you have to fucking pick it up. Well, that's what I was thinking. This is a kids game. They can't do that. Give me. Do you love that I'm spamming the two button? What do their shop points even do? It gives you stuff every 10. So you get free free stuff. That's how I got the cake mix. Alright, what's he gonna give you now? Let me see. <gasps> I got an egg! <gasps> Fuck yeah, he was wanting one of these! I think I can get a moose if I take a cake mix and an egg together. What are these? Okay, one of these, please. Oh, thank God. I can leave! <coughs> Still dying. The killer is escaping! I just looked over and I just see my poor chair. Yeah. It's got like a, a fucking hole. <laughs> yeah, I offered to replace it and you said no. It brings character. In my opinion, it brings character. I don't even know how to fix that. I, don't, I think it's too far gone. <laughs> I, think, I think just a little bit. Yeah. Oh fuck, what was it gonna bring up? Oh yeah, when would you want to do the flip side Pit of Hundred Trials? Um... We could do it before the final chapter. Yeah, that'd be cool. They do bring some pretty good loot. Yeah, in preparation for the final chapter, we can, we can do that. Yay! All right, surely we get. Surely. Surely we hit. Crimey. Eight percent. That's like eight out of a hundred. That is so true. Oh dang Fuck. it! Fuck. <laughs> is that your mom? <laughs> yeah. I don't know what she screamed about. Do we have a mouse? Good thing you have four little dogs. <laughs> so get it. Yeah. Trappy bubble yummy put it in your tummy one more second and then brrrr. <laughs> oh, dang it. Oh, dang it. I want what I, I wish I could look up game data for my other ones. How long did it take me to get this fucking miracle dinner from the last to other ones? This thing better be worth it. Yeah, or else I'm killing myself. <laughs> That's three mistakes in a row. God damn it! It's like me and my God. brothers. <laughs> Wait, you guys were all mistakes? No, I think I just was. <laughs> damn, I'm so sorry. No, this one's it. This one's it for sure. I feel it in my. I got this feeling inside my bones. And it goes electric when I turn it on. Well, it's not a mistake. That's pretty cool. Space food. Fuck yeah! I can eat in space and make and get 50 HP. This one. Here, you can pick out a mystery box after this one. You can assign a key to it. <laughs> Fuck! Well, I mean, it's, it's something. This is not. Yay! More inky soup! Woohoo, I love inky soup. Alright, which one? Uh, second one. Alright. 
I'm thinking it's gonna be a honey candy. I'm thinking it's gonna be a miracle dinner. All right. So we're both Fuck. wrong. <laughs> it's... What I really meant was a mistake. It's it it's okay. It's fine. This one is a miracle dinner. God damn it. Nope, it's another inky soup. <laughs> That's right. not an inky soup. This one. This one for sure, guys. I wish I could speed this up. Yeah. This ain't got no speed up functionality. I wish. Watch it be a healthy salad. <coughs> Which, if so, we can go right out. God damn it. It's a coupe tea. Alright. Right. This one's a mistake. This one is a miracle dinner. And it's called a miracle dinner because, oh boy, it's a miracle that we got anything good from a fucking mystery box. <laughs> Please be a healthy salad, because at least I can get one of the other things that we need. God damn it, I wasted that thing for nothing! Well. Wait, I just remember. We'll get it back next time. Yeah, wait, I just remember. I want to see if this is available. Just, just as a little thing. No, fine, I'll go up the elevator this time. Meow. I want to see if we're able to access it now. Or if it's like, you have to wait another fucking chapter for it. Cause that, that's how things in this town happen. Elevators stop working when, when Mario- ma, Elevators start working when Mario's gone. <laughs> when, once he's here, they, they're all just abrupt. Everything breaks. Everyone... I don't know. I had a thing going on there. And then I forgot. <laughs> nice. Nice that sense. Do. And I fucked it up. I'm so sorry. Yeah, you really should be. Yeah. This way. Yeah, I don't know if the elevator's broken. <gasps> it's not broken. Let's a fucking go. Oh. Oh. God damn it! <laughs> Looks like you can't get in there yet. Yeah, I gotta go to fucking roundabout way. God damn it. Yeah. Fuck! <laughs> but, we'll look into this a little bit later on. But doesn't it look familiar to you? Yeah. It's the pit of 100 trials. There's two pit of 100 trials in this game. <laughs> It's a pit of 200 trials. It's actually, there's flip size pit of 100 trials, and then there's flop size pit of 100 trials. Nice. They give you different stuff, different rewards, different enemies, and, and you'll see the difference whenever we do. This one's definitely post game. I'm not doing this one during the elf, like the story mode. Fair enough. The other one I will, because that one's not that bad, but. Yeah, but. <sighs> Anyways. Thanks for watching us just sit here and ramble on yeah. while we while we cook up some dishes. Uh, surely we'll get that miracle dinner one of these days. Yay! But until then. Yeah. Bye. Bye bye.